new to my YouTube channel, please do click that subscribe button and um, you can also click that notification bell button so you're updated to uh, my new videos that I'm uploading. And also, um, if this video helps you guys, please do hit that like button. So my name is Jamdi TV. I upload a um, video for those um, aspiring applicants of call center, right? So you can pass this for free without paying anything, right? So um, I know guys that I've been mentioning this middle class from my very first video from, um, for those, um, what do you call that, initial and final interview. I've also me uh, mentioned it on my Tell Me Something About Yourself video and even on my, um, um, they call the Tell Performance actual um, interview video. So um, bear with me if um, it's been a couple of months ago and I've just uploaded it just now because I'm just so busy with my work. Alright, so without further ado, let's get started. So anyway guys, for our video today, that would be Model Class and I'm sure that you're going to pass this 100% and we have here the questions with key answers. Actually, um, I have here um, a specific questions and key answers. But not all guys, okay? <laughs> not all. Alright, so let's get started. So, um, this is actually the um, actual screenshot um, of my middle test. So, um, as you can see guys, I have here 100%. 100%. Um, I've already done all of that. I don't know why um, they didn't put answer on that first. Um, first which is um, data entry audio 2 and on my typing test but guys I passed that 100% and I admit this model test I'm within 10 companies out of 12 companies so guys you can really use this and I mean this video will be very helpful for you alright um, so um, if in your past you did not pass this model test right now you're going to pass this right so, um, let's go to the part one. Alright. So, part one will be its data entry OD2. So, instruction, um, this assessment is audio based. Please listen to the recording carefully while including the customer details and the boxes provided. Second, please follow the format indicated. Third, you can only take this assessment once. Fourth, click finish attempt button once done with the assessment. Alright, so what's in this part one, guys? Alright, so as being said, it is actually an audio based, alright? So which means you're going to listen to an audio based and you're going to, um, what do we call that, um, encode your answer. So um, just a quick heads up, guys. Um, um, Alright, so Jam D, what, what are we going to um, listen, okay? Or what are we going to hear in this part one? Alright, so it's like um, we're going to listen to a call, okay? And after that, um, you're going to, um, you have to catch up um, the name of the, um, what do you call it, of the caller, the address, the zip code, all of those number, as well as the phone number, you also have to catch that up. And, um, yes, um, some important details. So, um, I highly encourage you guys to, what do you call that, um, use the, um, what do you call that, for example, in, um, Connecticut, um, we're going to use CT only. Alright, so um, it's like um, the um, short term of um, the states in um, USA, right? So um, another thing, of course, you can also do um, research in Google. Okay, as long as you heard the zip code, you can just um, type it in the Google. It's not bad, guys, for as long as you're sure that you get it right. The spelling. You get the spelling right. Okay? So, um, that's just a simple tips, guys, for you to pass this um, part one. Because um, this is actually the part that is hard to pass. But, no worries, guys. Um, you can do that. Um, just give me a moment. Alright, 
so um anyway guys this is a um a bonus for this um they call that um for this video since um you waited for too long like it takes um a couple of months before i uploaded this so um there they want to get the actual data entry audio which is the part one so you, you just have to subscribe guys and then um actually it's fine if you don't click that notification bell and like button you just have to subscribe um as long as you watch this video um go ahead and click that subscribe button and you have to comment subscribe all right again um after watching this video you just have to click that subscribe button and comment subscribe and then um pick a screenshot of that and um, i'll be putting um um the description of my page um link my fb page link on this um, description of this video and um you have to send your screenshot on my page all right and after that i will be providing to you my um actual answer and um i'm 100 percent um i'm 100 percent that you're going to pass this part one because this is actually the hard part of this model test all right so without further ado go ahead <laughs> Alright, so without further ado, let's get started with the part 2. Part 2 says our listening comprehension basic. Okay, so instructions, this is a 20 item multiple choice assessment. You'll have to listen to an audio recording prior answering the question. Second, you can only take this assessment once. Third, choose the best answer from the options provided. And fourth, you have to click finish attempt button was done with the assessment so as being said guys this is a 20 item multiple choice assessment multiple choice guys so you don't have to worry so um and this part two guys um you'll have to listen again to um to a call and then um you're going to answer um with just a multiple choice um from a to D actually and it's just easy because it's actually situational so um it's very manageable and it's really easy guys <laughs> so as you can see i pass it a hundred percent because it's just easy all right so just a quick heads up as well um you can only take this assessment once so um i have these um tips to pass part two and what are those so um first guys we we don't have time limit so as much as possible make sure to get the right answer right so um you may take um it even more almost or for as long as you are satisfied your, with your answer so um again guys you can take this um for one hour or two hours or um it depends on you for as long as um you're satisfied and you're sure with your answer um, as being said guys, this is really um, simple, this is really easy because it's just situational. So I'm pretty sure guys that you're going to pass this. Alright, so second one would be play the audio. Um, repeat it until you get the correct answer. So um, this is what I really love about this. And you can actually um, repeat the um, audio until you get the correct answer. So you can um, repeat playing the audio <laughs> um, for how many times that you want. It's um, it's actually fine um, as long as um, you're sure that your answer is correct. All right. So the answer is in the question. All right. Just listen attentively. So there you go. You are guys. Um, that's the very great tips um, to pass this um, the answer is in the question you just have to listen attentively right and the last one would be smile and do your best um, Ate Jam is here <laughs> alright so um, what else um, part 3 CSR listening comprehension comprehend so what's in this part 3 alright so instruction this is a 28 item multiple choice assessment you are provided audio recording per question choose the best answer from the options provided 
and you can only take this assessment once. Click finish attempt, but on was done with the assessment. So um guys, this is just um what do we call that? This is just like part two. Um it's just that this is 28 item, but it's almost the same. It's also um what do we call that situational and you're going to listen to the um audio recording and you're going to choose multiple choice from A to D actually so it's very easy as well so I'm um, just like my tips and part two you can also apply it here you can play it multiple times and um, you can take this for an R if you if you like okay <laughs> for you R all right so um part four so this is very a quick video guys I'm not going to take this for long because um you know um, I just have um, a very um, few <laughs> few minutes in making this because um, I have a lot of work to do. Alright, so um, in this part you, you will be given a topic and you have to gain 35 words per minute. So I know guys that most of us is having a hard time with this. Um, typing test for one minute, it's hard for us to gain 35 words per per minute so um Jambi how did you pass this <laughs> how did I pass this so let me go ahead and share this to you as well so tips and technique I have here the tips and technique for you to pass this um, typing test so um, first one make sure to practice in a PC not in laptop if you are going on site if you're going on site guys because um um, what do you call that? If you practice um, typing in laptop, it, um, the keyboard is different from the keyboard in PC. And mind you guys, it will take you too long actually. <laughs> but um, the good thing there is they're going to allow you to repeat it. They're going to give you a chance. But if I were you guys, um, you have to practice um, your typing skills, right? Because it's really um, important. Okay, so um, second practice makes perfect. So as I mentioned, you really have to practice um, just to make sure that you're going to pass this. So um, make sure you have no error in a word. Um, if you got mistaken, make sure to get back at, um, to it and correct it. So this is actually one of the, what do we call that, um, um, wrong information that, um, that are being taught to us. Like, um, um, whenever you're taking in a typing test, they're going to um, tell you um, just a quick reminder. Um, if you get mistaken, um, don't get don't don't um, get back to it. Um, just go ahead and type and type and type. But actually, guys, that is really really wrong. All right, it's really wrong. Why? Why? Because, for example, I'm um, you're typing, and then um, you have one um, incorrect word. So um that would be deducted to your um scores. So um aside from you did it's like um you have a deduction of two points, something like that. So I highly encourage you guys that um if you have one error to um go ahead and get back to it. Correct it, alright? And um after correcting it, go ahead and type once again. So in that way, um, as long as you have a perfect of 35 words per minute, um, you don't have, um, because for example, you have a total of 35 words per minute. However, um, you have a mistake of 5. So even if you've already typed 35 words, um, um, and then you have a mistake of 5 words, it will be deducted to your 35 words per minute. So you'll have a final score of 30. So it's really... It's, you know, it's really hurtful. <laughs> so that's why I highly encourage you not to get any mistake. You can actually get back to it. Um, erase it and correct it, alright? And then memorize the content you're going to type before typing. That way you will be more faster, right? So this is what I usually do. Um, like I'm going to memorize the um, first sentence up to second sentence and then i'm going to type it very fast because i memorized it already 
so um that way um it will be more faster because if you don't memorize it um the tendency would be you will be um um what do we call that if you're just a beginner you will be um reading it and then you're going to um look at the keyboard and you're going to type it so it's really um you know it will consume a time a second or a minute so you're not going to pass this so that's the main reason why i highly encourage you guys to memorize the first or second content first to second content if you can uh, i mean first to second sentence if you can do that please go ahead and do that so um it will be very easy for you so um don't worry kajami um ate jam is here you're on my channel so i prepare here the test i have taken kindly practice <laughs> i'm sorry i have um vernacular words here <laughs> Alright, so guys, these are the, um, yes, part 4 timing test, I take in 100% and, um, you'll take this. So, um, the tiger, Panthera tigris, one of the world's most magnificent and revered animals. So, this is actually, um, the actual typing test that I've taken and, um, you can repeat this for, um, um, if you take this um, Moodle test at your home, you can take this um, for 10 times as long as you're not going to click submit, alright? Um, you'll just, um, you, you're just you just going to, um, what do you call that, click the um, retake, alright? But you're not going to click submit. And um, you can submit it when you're satisfied, when you already have 100% or um, 95%, something like that. So um, here guys, you can take a screenshot of this, memorize it before taking this model test. So as being said, <laughs> I have here some of the answer key. Although, please do subscribe to this channel and um, comment um, subscribe on this video and send a screenshot to my FB page Jamdi TV as well so that um, I can send to you um, the answer for the part 1 the actual answer actually so um that would be all today um jemmy thank you very much for watching this video and please do hit that subscribe button i know this is a very quick video but i hope um you learned something from this video um for my next video i think that would be um percent <laughs> i'm not that sure though and um i don't know um if I will be um, uploading it on this month or next month, I'm not that sure though because I'm very um, busy with my work. Um, I'm currently working as a call center still. <laughs> I've been staying here for, um, um, I'm not going to mention it, but um, guys, good luck on your application in call center and um, please um, do your best in passing um the interview as well as the training right 